Auto It Sunday, episode number 54, or season two, episode two, that takes place in February, second month of the year. Well, this week, there's a whole lot of deuces in the days of the month. We have the 20th, the 21st, 22nd, the list goes on. Now, that's a whole lot of deuces. Now, why am I saying that? Because this week, I'm going to call the week of the deuce. <laughs> Uh, about Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I was uh, I was just about ready to to cancel Shoutout Sunday. I had even done up the whole graphic, uh, not all of Shoutout Sunday, but this week, because I was so I was such a bottle of emotions, and I'm like, I can't come on Shoutout Sunday and lie to you. I can't tell you that this week was the best week of my life. It was awesome because it'd be a complete lie. It was a terrible week. So. I got thinking, you know, as the week went on and the more I dealt with it, the easier it got. Um, and obviously, I'm not going to cancel Shout Out Sunday. Are you kidding me? This is where I can turn a negative into a positive. I am I'm the giggling guru. I'm supposed to be the best at this. So for me to cancel it because I had a bad week would have been a terrible decision. So instead, we're going to make a margarita. Now, that may be confusing. It, uh, you know, when life gives you the lemons, they say make lemonade. Well, I found a really good margarita recipe with some lemons. So let's make a margarita, will we? <laughs> Come on. It's going to be a bit of a different episode this week. Um, I'm not, I don't have, you know, one person per day of the week. I do have seven shout outs that I'm going to give, but they're not, you know, specifically for each day because most of these people were there every single day of this week. Um, so I want to still give my gratitude, but I also want to take this opportunity to maybe find out some tips and tricks that you guys use in order to, you know, to be happy or to get happy again. So I want to, I want to start with, uh, with some questions. I want to, uh, get some, get some participation from you. If you, if you would, that would be fantastic. Dad, welcome. Cindy, I can't wait to hear your margarita recipe. It will be freaking awesome. Heck yes, it is. <laughs> it's uh, it uh, yeah, very good. <laughs> so I wanna I wanna kick it off with the first question. Um, if I could just get you guys to answer in the comments, I'm gonna put this question up for you. There we go. Are you always happy? Are you one of those people that is just always the happiest person in the room? If you are, pump a one into the comments. If you're not, if Sometimes you're happy, sometimes you're sad, sometimes you're angry, sometimes you're just full of joy. If you have different emotions, pump a two in the comments. Let's let people know that, you know, emotions are, are so natural. You know, if you get upset, that's okay. You know, we can get through it. If you get angry, if you get sad or depressed, there's always a way through it. So let me know in the comments, are you a one person? Do you, are you just always happy or are you a two person? Drop that deuce in the comments, if you will. Let's, uh, let's see what everybody's got. Grandma Peggy, she's a one person. She's, she's always happy. Cindy's a two. My mom's a two. It happens, right? We all have emotions. It's a natural thing. So if you get upset, if you get angry, there is a way out. There's always going to be a way out. So I want to share with you kind of how, how I got through that. I got some shout outs here and we'll get to the shout outs. They're in no particular order. Um, I just kind of, you know, thought through what made my week better than it could have been. And uh, so I've got, I've got seven people I'm going to give shout outs to. So before we do the shout outs, just like normal, we're going to play a little ditty. Yo, give me some shout outs, shout outs here. But not that one. <laughs> a little song. Here. All right, so right out of the shoot, I got to give a big old shout out to my mom. I'm a mama's boy. I love my mom. She's always there. Um, you know, I'm pretty sure I talk to her every single day this week. Anytime I have a big decision or anytime I'm going through anything, I talk with my mom. She helps me, you know, she can really put emotions aside and, you know, use logic 
which when you're full of emotions, logic is exactly what you freaking need. And, uh, but yeah, so I got to give you a shout out, mom. You're always there for me anytime I need some advice. And you just always happen to have the right advice, which uh, I got to give you a big shout out for, mom. I freaking love you. Thank you so much for always being there for me. And here is your shout out. Yo, give me some shout-outs, shout-outs here. Moving on to dad. I got to give a big old shout-out to my dad. Same thing, talk to him probably every day this week, you know, and he really helped me through a lot of things. And also, I don't know if you know this, but he got nominated for the Kind Hearts Award. He It's uh, some award in the county of Grand Prairie here, and he got nominated by a bunch of his neighbors because he's always plowing their driveways. The guy's a freaking beauty absolute freaking beauty and you know just a total role model i you know i strive to be just like you and mom you guys are freaking rock stars and i love the both of you so i gotta give you a big old shout out dad here it is I'll give you some shout out, shout out here. so now i gotta give a shout out to miss ashley you know what a beauty absolutely love you you know you're a strong girl you went through a lot and uh i'm just happy to be here for you so I got to give you a shout out because you're a rock star and I love you. So here you go. Yo, give me some shout outs, shout outs here. I got to give a big old shout out to this little man, Austin. I talked talked about him a little bit earlier in the show. You know, mom said what, what makes her happy is seeing others happy. And uh, Austin was a huge proponent of helping me get happier because, uh, you know, just listening to him laugh, he's always happy. You know what he... I, I, not always. Like I say right at the beginning, we're not all always happy. That's not a reality. That's not a not a real thing. But, uh, you know, listening to him laughing and having fun, that uh, that makes me happy as well. So, Austin, i got to give you a big old shout out. Yo, give me some shout out, shout out here. And we're going to move into Mr. Doug. What a freaking beauty. Absolute freaking beauty. Um. He's always there. Another guy I talk to you probably daily. You know, he knows when things are going on and he'll just reach out to me, you know, and that's why I, I dearly want to be there for you because I have all of these people that are always there for me and it, I, I need to be able to give that back. So Doug, I got to give you a big old shout out, man. You're a freaking beauty. Absolutely love you. And uh, well, here's your shout out. Yo, give me some shout out, shout out. Uh, what day was it? Yesterday, Saturday. I uh, went to Old Smokes Coffee. And uh, what did Tim do? Well, he buys buys us a, a shot. It uh, Or sends us over a shot, I guess. It was a, an espresso shot with, what it was a maple smoked coffee, espresso. And then it had some heavy cream in there and it was topped with whipped cream. Woo! That was a tasty little treat. Let me tell you what. So, Tim, I got to give you a big old shout out, man, because that was pretty cool. I felt like a rock star in there getting uh, getting shots sent over. That was pretty cool, man. So, it put a smile on my face, and uh, I'm going to give you a shout out. Yo, give me some shout out, <laughs> shout out here. Oh, what a beauty. Yeah, if you haven't been to Old Smokes, I'm telling you, check it out. I uh, I went down there with... Dana. Being there with Dana was awesome. We had some coffee, some conversation. Same thing. I was able to just kind of talk about what was going on. And uh, same thing. She, you know, she was there to listen. She was there to give me a little bit of advice. And uh, so Dana, I got to give you a big old shout out. Thanks for, uh, thanks for asking me out to coffee. It was awesome. And now I'm going to give you a shout out. Yo, give me some shout outs, shout outs here. Well, that's seven shout outs for seven days. They weren't exactly Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, but we still got seven in there because no matter how dark your days may be, there's still things to be grateful for. So on that note, I'm going to play a little ditty and then we're going to wrap it all up. Dad says, helping other people and just being with family. Well, 
I, uh, I can see that that obviously is very true. You're getting an award for helping people. You freaking beauty. <laughs> Auntie Sandy, hello. Lori, how the heck are you? Well, shout out Sunday episode number 54 was a little unorthodox, a little different than normal. But you know what? I think it's important to, to you know, to go through these things because what, if you're just always happy, you don't know how good it is. You know, to have a little bit of unhappiness, a little bit of sadness, a little bit of disappointment, maybe it's not the worst thing. Maybe maybe we all need a little bit of that sometimes to realize that things are pretty darn good. So with that being said, thank you guys for tuning in. Love each and every one of you. And if you want to talk, let me know. I'm here. I'm absolutely here. So thank you guys so much. And we'll check you later. <laughs>